Hey YouTube land, uh, my name is Cliff and this is the first product review I've ever done to put on YouTube and the reason why I'm doing it is because um, I've been interested in these uh, LED pixel lights for a little while, probably a couple years now after watching the great Christmas light fight and seeing some folks using it in their Christmas display. But what's not on YouTube is really, um, it seems a little complicated. It seems like, uh, I'm not sure, I don't have a soldering iron, I don't have uh, electrical experience, things like that. And uh, the guys that are programming these things, um, they seem like they have a lot more uh, experience, which kind of shied me away from um, buying these, um, but I really wanted the features to them. So I'm making this video because um, I wanted to show everybody, it's it's kind of easy if you if you just want to have some cool lights that do some cool effects. It's pretty easy. Um, if you want to get more complicated, ob obviously these lights, um, they're addressable, individual addressable lights. So you can do more things with them if you get different controllers. Um, but for my purpose, um, at least to begin with, I'd like to eventually learn more. But at least to be begin with, um, I was uh, kind of iffy about buying any of it to see if it worked. But uh, to begin with, this is really cool. Um, so I purchased these pixel lights and I'll put the description down below um, from Amazon. Um, there's 50 in a pack. Um, what, what, light, what I liked about these, um, they're individual, individually addressed if you want to, but the cord is black. And so if I'm going to use them for Christmas display and other things where I don't really want the cord to be seen, um, this cord is black and um, that's what I like. The other ones that uh, I've seen and a lot of them I've seen have the different color cords. Um, I think it's red, blue, and white, which is fine if you're going to make signs and different things where you're going to hide the cord. But for me, it was uh, to try to find something that had a black cord. Um, I know as I get further into it um, that each one of these cords, uh, there's power, there's data, and the ground. Um, but uh, as I get further into it and I get different controllers and things like that, then I'll then I'll move forward and and maybe move to a different color. But um, these I'm actually going to use. I'm going to buy one more set of this um, because it plugs in so easy and use these for my Christmas tree and um, I'll show you a video of that later but just to uh, to go through real quick um, I purchased these I purchased this which is a controller I think it was like eight dollars I think these were like 14 to 19 dollars um, again the description will be down there and then I purchased a 12 volt power supply um, which was like seven or eight dollars from Amazon and um, I went with 12 volt you can do a 5 or 12 volt um, but from my research and uh, if I'm gonna eventually do something more with them it looked like the 12 volt was a little more stable so I got the 12 volt I think it was only like a dollar more to get the 12 volt um, than the 5 volt so let me just show you really quickly how easy it is because um, I was afraid they weren't gonna work at all um, it comes with a plug on each end and let's see there's a plug on each end, so we're going to use this plug first, and it's as simple as plugging this in. I'll try to do it with one hand here. Hopefully, I can get that. <laughs> it's not. We'll go closer. So I can use two hands. Okay. Sorry about that. 